hi there it's Joe uh, just posting the second video today about my journey with gastric sleeve surgery scheduled here in a few weeks in Mexico um, so in my earlier video today I talked about my doctor's visit um, but in this one I wanted to talk about some things that I bought over the weekend posted about and have been trying um, so the first one was I wanted to have some pre-made protein drinks even though I didn't want to rely too heavily on them uh, but needed something for when I was on the go. So had bought the um, EAS Advantage uh, drinks at Sam's Club, which I posted about, um, and was really pleased. They're, they were actually quite good. Um, I've drank the Atkins shakes in the past, and they're very similar to that. Um, I'd heard to stay away from the Atkins stuff because they're a little bit high in fat. Um, but this one, 17 grams of protein, 11 ounces, 110 calories, 3 grams of fat. So... Uh, very pleased about that. Um, so another item was I tried using my Ninja, um, which if you missed that post, it's basically like the Magic Bullet or like a blender um, type thing. It had gotten better reviews than the Magic Bullet. So picked that up at Sam's Club for 50 bucks last weekend. Thing works great. Very pleased. It's got like a small blender size, maybe about that big half blender size. Um, I read some stuff online that they don't last forever, and so um, I was kind of noted in the instructions that you're not meant to kind of pull the button down. You're supposed to sort of pulse it, so we'll see how that goes. I bought the extended warranty at Sam's Club. It was like $6 for a year, so um, looking forward to that. It's uh, There were a number of Ninja products out there, but this one was the Ninja, um, I think it's called Miss, Mix Master Professional or Mix Master Pro. Um, tends to run anywhere from like 60 to $80 online, 50 at Sam's Club, and I think 40 at Walmart if you can find it. Um, so that's great. Really excited about that. Um, the other is uh, my order came today from Unjury. Um, I had actually ordered online their starter pack because I'd heard good things about Unjury protein powder. Um, so with tax, it was $27.20. Uh, I got 10 packets in a box today. Um, so it came with a few things actually. Um, came with this small Rubbermaid bottle, um, which I actually really like. I was just thinking today when I um, was trying out like a smaller protein shake that um, the cups I have, it looks like nothing in the cup that looks awful. Um, and so this is great. It's like the little smaller size, which um, I think is, uh, is going to be good. So I'm excited about that. Keep me from going and buying one. Um, it also came with a um, thermometer, which um, there's probably a reason for why it's in there. I don't know what it is, but I'll take it. Um, then it came with uh, 10 packets of Undry in different flavors, which is really cool. So now I can try it out, see if I like it um, without buying like one giant bin of uh, a single flavor. So it came with um, strawberry sorbet. Um, I think there's a chocolate, um, an unflavored, which um, a lot of people like because you can put it in a bunch of different stuff. Um, one of the ones I'm interested to try, I'd heard about it online, is the chicken soup flavor. Um, you know, I've definitely read people say that they get sick of like the protein shakes and so the chicken soup flavor might be something a little bit different. Um, so that should be cool. Try, I'll try one of those out, let you know how it goes. But the starter pack from unjury.com, U-N-J-U-R-Y, seems like a good buy. Um, another item that I put in my protein shakes that I thought I would share because I'm a huge fan of the product um, is Omega Swirl. Um, but I'm going to put a caveat for gastric sleeve patients and bariatric patients. So Omega Swirl is um, fish oil, but it has kind of like a smoothie texture and a smoothie taste. This one's mango peach. Um, it's really great if you take fish oil for protein shakes. Um, it tastes good. It's got like a great texture. Um, a dietitian turned me on to it about a year ago. Um, but I am going to stop the fish oil before surgery and uh, probably for a little while after. Um, it can technically be a blood thinner. There's alternating stuff out there about it online. But um, it's kind of the same reason that a doctor would tell you to like stop taking garlic or ginkgo, those kind of things, because they can thin your blood. So um, I've heard maybe that can slow your healing after. I'm not sure how much I buy into it, but um, just to be safe, I'll stop taking it beforehand and then um, probably not take it for, I don't know, maybe at least six weeks, maybe maybe eight after. So um, that's some stuff for you today. Hope all is well, and um, I'll tell you how it goes tomorrow with the other bariatric surgeon. Thanks. Bye.